whose real name is Shoko Dudem Ongo Amadike, has been sentenced to death after being tried for three years for kidnapping and other notorious criminal activities. He was sentenced to death yesterday by a federal high court sitting in Lagos after he was found guilty of kidnapping. Chuku Dubem Omu Amadike, who is popularly known as Evans, made waves years ago after he was arrested for kidnapping. His oppression was uncovered and he was found guilty of countless of kidnappings. Evans is one of the biggest criminals in Nigeria. When he was arrested, the authorities uncovered all the fortune the man has gathered with his illegal criminal acts. Evans made over 6 billion naira from kidnapping and was regarded as one of Nigerian leading billionaires. But after his arrest in 2017, his properties, cars, house and assets worth over millions of naira. But after his arrest in 2017, his properties, cars, houses and assets worth over billions of naira were seized by the Nigerian federal government. He was then charged to court and his case has remained in court since 2017 till yesterday, 20th August 2020, when the Federal High Court in Lagos finalized his case. He was found guilty of all the charges leveled against him and was sentenced to death. Evans was arrested in 2017 after the kidnap of one chief Donatus Duru, a billionaire businessman from the eastern part of Nigeria. Evans collected a whooping sum of $600,000 and still never released the victim. In addition, he confessed that he was guilty for most high profile kidnap in Nigeria, where he was arrested and charged to court. Investigations revealed that he had a wife and children that were living large and fine. Unfortunately, his wife and children have gone back to poverty after all his properties worth billions of naira were seized by the Nigerian federal government. Well, it looks like Evans has finally met his water law. The federal high court sitting in Lagos sentenced him to death on Thursday. The billionaire has finally gotten a verdict for all his crimes in Nigeria and I believe this will serve as a lesson for those planning to go into kidnapping or other forms of criminal activities. Chuku the Ono Amadike, popularly known as Evans, is a Nigerian notorious kidnapper. He is a native of Newi, a small town in Anambra State, in the southeastern part of Nigeria. He is sometimes referred to as a billionaire kidnapper because the Nigerian police force believes he is one of the richest criminals in the kidnapping business in Nigeria. He has made over $9 billion in kidnapping. In some of his operations, he made amounts up to $1 million per kidnap. The Inspector General of Police Special Intelligence Response Team of the Nigerian Police Force also described him as a very smart, crafty, and intelligent kidnapper, having escaped arrest for four years, even though he was on the most wanted list. Evans was arrested in Lagos on 11th June 2017 and was reprimanded in prison and waiting trial. Evans undergone a 52 count charges of multiple murders, armed robberies, kidnappings, unlawful possession of firearms, unlawful possession of ammunition, conspiracy among other charges. Specifically, he is being charged of unlawful capture of Uche Okerafo in Festac area of Lagos State on 21st November 2017 and demanded a ransom of $2 million. According to the Director of Public Prosecutions, Mrs. Titilayo Chiti Bay, Evans contravenes Section 409 and Subsection 269 of the Criminal Laws of Lagos State 2011. Unfortunately, his end came yesterday after he was found guilty of all the 52 charges bordering on murder, armed robbery, kidnapping, and unlawful possession of firearm, conspiracy, and other criminal charges. Evans was sentenced to death by hanging.
I don't know my no names. Okay. You understand me now? But anybody I see that I know that I know anything about is I can easily understand. Uh -huh. Because you know sometimes something will happen, you will not know the name of the person. I have people that give me information. I, I don't know where I can find anybody who make phone call. Then we'll gather together. We can meet we can meet along the road. Like along the road, and I tell ask somebody to wait for you. Where you can they pick in with motor? I can make the call, okay. or they can go and collect the money. It's when they bring the when they bring the money, we have to share it, all of us. The highest money we collected is from first stack, one million dollars. From somebody even in first stack, okay. just because uh, maybe they are wasting time. You understand? Because when they are wasting time, you have to wait for the money to be complete. called me that the man that police have bust here the police have bust here I said why what happened how come so the other one was telling me I said it's a lie if you people want to tell me what happened you tell me what happened I was accusing Oshie I was threatening him so I can be able to find out what happened he was talking to me I said I must not that you are telling me that you are sorry someone escaped from here you have to tell me, let me know how it happens. You understand? So that is how it, it, it goes. So are you convinced now? That to know how it happens, are you convinced now? I'm not convinced. I'm not convinced. Yes. You still believe Uche sold you out? Uche or Adebayo? Sold you out? Yes. You are not convinced that the man escaped from you? Yes. Why are you not convinced? Why I'm not convinced is that Mm, Oga showed me something. Oga showed had a man. I'm a little bit. It can happen that way. But that man himself don't have that mind. The man himself, I'm talking about, doesn't have that. He can't stand up from there. We never suspected anything. We know one or two of the guys who stayed here. We, we, we used to see them around. They, they, they greet me. I greet them. I don't know. But uh, I never suspected anything. You never, you never heard like the midnight dropping up of. No, no, nothing. No shouting, no, no hassles, nothing. Because there were just, I thought there were only two people living in this place. Uh, one young man who, very fair complexion, another, another one who looks like uh, an autistic person. You know, he usually goes to buy petrol. Just those two people. And the lady that comes in once in a while, I, don't, I think that's the guy that, 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 that feeds them. I started in Anambara. Yeah. Then from Anambara, I moved to Edo. Then I come to Lagos. I have people that give me information. Each time I, go, I want to go for a person, I will connect on phone. I will, I will call them on phone. Like, let's meet so so and so please. Before we start going for the pension, we will be kidna we'll kidnap. The highest money we collected is from first time, one million dollars. From somebody even in first time. The arrest of Evans and his gang member is the beginning to the end of kidnapping and other violence.